Hi YouTube, today it is the 18th of September 2013, Apple has released their new version of iOS, which is iOS 7, so without further ado, we'll get on and start downloading it, go to software updates, check for update, iOS 7 is now available, download and install, Agree to the terms and conditions. Okay, so according to Apple, we've got about 20 minutes remaining. So, time to just sit and wait. Just give you a little bit of information about iOS 7. It's been completely redesigned by Johnny Ive, the guy that originally saved Apple with his design of the big bubbled back iMac and it supports the iPhone 4 and above, the iPad 2 and above, and the iPod Touch generation 5 and above. So sorry those of you who still have fourth generation iPod Touches and below, you won't be getting iOS 7. As you can see on screen, this update features a beautiful new design and contains hundreds of new features including Control Center, AirDrop, iTunes Radio and improvements to Notification Center, Multitasking, Camera, Photos, Safari, Siri and more. That's a little bit more information there for you. If you want to read that, just press pause on the video. Okay, so we'll come back once this is finished downloading, so we'll see you in just a moment. Okay folks, that did take a little longer than expected. It is now preparing the update. It has taken probably around about 30 minutes. It did fluctuate um, the time remaining. Uh, it did go up to two hours at one point uh, and then it suddenly dropped back down again. But you do have to take into account that there probably are a few million devices worldwide that are trying to get this all at the same time. So it's just preparing the update at the moment. Okay, so we're just coming up to the first restart now. That's taken around about an hour and five minutes or just more. I think the installation file must have been really, really densely packed and compressed because that took around about half an hour to prepare the update. And due to network congestion, uh, it took around about half an hour to download it. 
So we're just verifying the update now. Okay, so here we are. It's all installed. It's reset. So we've got the hello, please slide to set up in multiple different languages. Update completed. Your iPhone was updated successfully. There are just a few more steps to follow and then you finished. Continue. Right, we want to enable location services. Uh, to put my password in here, I just blanked it off for my own security's sake. Updating iCloud settings. Here it lists your email addresses and telephone numbers that um, you can use for iMessage and FaceTime. Yet again, I've masked them out for my own security. Uh, find my iPhone in iOS 7. Yes, we want to use that. Uh, enter a passcode for when you unlock your phone. I won't do that at the moment, I'll do that at a later date. And welcome to iPhone. Let's get started. Okay, so Spotlight has now moved. You can now swipe down from the middle of the screen and it gives you the uh, search field. So you can search for whatever app you're looking for. Swap so down from the top, we've got Notification Center again. Um, slightly different than what it was before, but still, still the same action to get to it. And also now we have a swipe up from the bottom and we've got Control Center, where we can put on airport mode, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, Do Not Disturb, and our orientation lock. Below that, we've got our brightness settings. Underneath that, again, the transport controls for your music. We've got a section for airplay. Then we've got torch, stopwatch, calculator, and camera. Now, if we double click, we've got the multitasking window where we can access the apps that are currently open. We can now just slide up to close those apps. And if you want to, you can do two at a time, like so. There we go, and it's that simple. Okay, back at the home screen. Here we have all the apps that were restored through the uh, backup. So all my apps are still there now. And that is pretty much it, folks. So thank you very much for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe, and share this video with everyone you know.